Hey everyone, here's a question on ratios and the question is say it whether the following ratios are proportional or not. We have given two questions. In the first one we have 20 is to 45 and 4 is to 9. Now before we solve this, let us understand what we mean by the word proportional. The saying if the ratios are proportional or not. So proportional is nothing but equal. So we have to check if the ratios are equal or not. So instead of using the word equal, they are using a word proportional. So if the ratios are same or the ratios are equal, we are going to say it has prop they are proportional. Now there are many ways of solving this. I am going to first show you the very easy method which you can use if the question comes for the true or false or the fill in the blanks or any one mark question type. So what is that way? In the first one, we have given the ratio 20 is to 45 and we have 4 is to 9. The easy method is you have to bring the ratios to the lowest form or the reduced form. So reduced form means you have to cancel the number till you cannot cancel it further. Like in the first one, we have 20 is to 45 and we know that ratios can be written in fractional form which is equal to 20 by 45. Now this number I can cancel in 5 table. So 5 4s are 20 and 5 9s are 45. This is equal to 4 by 9 or the ratio will be 4 is to 9. And the second ratio what we have is also 4 is to 9. Yeah, And 4 is to 9 we cannot reduce further. You can see we got 4 is to 9 here and 4 is to 9 here. Which means they are equal, they are same, right? So we can say that 20 is to 45 and 4 is to 9 are proportional. This is easy way, you can reduce a number to the lowest form and you can check it. The other way or the textbook method, there is a one more method given the textbook that is you have to check if they are uh, like, you have to check the extremes and mean, the product of extreme and the mean. Now what are extreme and what are mean? Extreme are nothing but the one or the number which are at the corner, right? Uh, here 20 and 9, they are the corner, they are the ex extreme side. So 20 and 9 will be your extreme and the mean will be nothing but the number which are inside. So here 45 and 4 will be your mean and 20 and 9 will be your extreme. Now you have to find the product of here extreme that is 20 and 9 you have to find out. You have to find the product of the mean that is 4 and 45 and 4. And after finding the product you check if they are equal. If they are equal then they are proportional. If they are not then they are not proportional. Okay, so let us find out that. So we're gonna find out the product of extreme. So product of extremes will be product of extreme is equal to so extreme we have 20 and 9. So 20 multiplied by 9 is equal to 180. Now we're gonna find out the product of mean. So product of means will be so number which are inside that is 45 and 4. So 45 into 4 is also 180. So you can see that product of extreme and product of means they are equal. So we can conclude that therefore ratios are proportion. So ratios are proportional or they are in proportion. So this is the first question. We are going to do the same thing for second question. For second one you can try the easy method which I explained you. You can reduce a number to the lowest form and you can check it. And I am going to show you this product of mean and the product of extremes here. So we have to check if they are proportional or not. So let me raise a conclusion here. Okay. In the second question the ratios given are 9 is to 27 and we have 33 is to 11 so product of extreme is nothing but 9 into 11 so this is 9 into 11 which is 99 product of mean is 27 into 33 so 27 into 33 is equal to 891 you can see 99 and 891 they are not equal which means they are not proportional ratios are not proportional Therefore, ratios are not proportional. You can cancel the number, you can bring it to the reduced form, you can check if you are getting the answer correct or not. I hope this question is clear. Now in case you have any other further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.